Ballot box set on fire in Boston. The FBI now joining the investigation as official search for voters whose ballots were damaged or destroyed. Anna Myler is live in Copley Square with the latest. Anna? Liam, Secretary of the Commonwealth, William Galvin, is calling this a deliberate arson attack. He says this ballot drop box by the Boston Public Library had 122 ballots inside when someone set it on fire. Boston police say the fire happened just after 4 a.m. on Sunday. They released these surveillance photos of a man they are trying to identify. Secretary Galvin says most of the 122 ballots were not badly damaged, but 5 to 10 were destroyed. Now they're asking anyone who used the drop box between 2.30 p.m. on Saturday and 4 a.m. on Sunday to check their ballot status online as election officials work to make sure every vote gets counted. I'm very angry, again, looking at the good response that we had in the primary and certainly the million people, more than a million, that have already turned their ballot here. Uh, we know the process works. It is our intention to make sure that the individuals who uh, did this are apprehended and prosecuted. Uh, we want to make sure of the integrity of the electoral process. And you can see that the drop box itself was not damaged. It is still here and available for voters. You can track your ballot status either online or by calling the Boston Election Department. We have more information on that on our website, cbsboston.com. Reporting live in Boston, Anna Myler, WBZ This Morning.